Today we're going to install a new center console on the 2016 Dodge Dart. Alright, the first thing we're going to do is remove this piece here. That way we could insert the e-brake. Alright, next thing we're going to do is put in the center console. We're going to go ahead and just throw it in here real quick. Alright, you're just going to place it in here, just work it into place. Grab it from the back and slide it down. Try to get the e-brake to go in. Maybe lift it up a little bit higher. Get your arm out so it don't get stuck like mine is. Owie, jeez. Man, good thing you didn't freaking cut me. Pretty close. All right, now we're gonna work it in there. There it is. All right, now we're gonna just connect our three plugs that go right in here. There's our three plugs. And they should just perfectly fit into place. Sorry about that. Get the camera to place. There it is. Now the gray one with this gray one. Just like my neat both hands real quick. Alright, the gray one with the gray one. Slap it into place. This black piece with this upper one here. And just work it in there. All right, all the way till it snaps back into place. Now our three connections are secured. There is three connections up here you wanna make sure you have up here cause one is way down here. Just snap it into this little hook that it has to place it. And then let's put everything down. Let's pull this pigtail out. All right. And just work everything back into place. Back here is getting caught. All right, and we just want to work everything back into place. All right, it was the seat belt that got looped down. All right, now everything is into place here. We're gonna put oh this trim right here. We're gonna slide it into place just like so. Clip it down. Sweet. All right. Throw that back into neutral. Clip this down. Just like so. Perfect. All right, now we're gonna grab our e-brake trim. We're gonna place it into place there. Fuck, look at my arm. Um, put the e-brake down. Now what we're going to do is snap a ruski. We lost one. Dang it. <laughs> e brake back up. <laughs> eh, see what I tell you? Golly. And eh, we had that mother sucker up there already. Come here, mother sucker. <sighs> Man. Missed that my e brake trim and everything. Alright, just put everything back into place. E brake back down. Now we have these here. All right, now what we're gonna do is the center one. Oh, 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 my bad, I'm getting a hole ahead of myself. There is two seven millimeter screws. They're gonna go right here, and right here. Do, 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 do. Go in, screw. It's your hole, it's where you belong. All right, now we're gonna drive them in. We're gonna be using a seven millimeter. Where are you, seven? There you are, upside down seven. <laughs> You're just gonna drive it in, boom. And then drive it in, boom. All right. Now, what we're gonna do is place this trim into place. Connect all these three pigtails. This one's gonna snap into place if you get it close enough. There it is. And 
Snap. Snap. <laughs> Golly, snap. Yes. Uh, this one's gonna go up here. And that one's gonna snap into place. Beautiful. This one here is going to uh, snap. Then you turn this all the way down. And I hit the hazards. That means it's working. Sweet. All right, now we're gonna push this down a little bit to the side and put that into place. Push that down. And work it in. Oh, we gotta pull off the old tag. Oh. All right, just gotta work it into place. Cool. Everything snaps back into place. Now we're gonna put our screw there. We have our screws down there. Let me go to the other side. All right, I put the screw into place. Now we're just gonna drive it in. All right, we're gonna slap this trim back into place. All right, cool. Get the screw. Put it back into its place down here. This one is also a seven millimeter. Sorry for the bad angle camera. Or the bad camera angle. Bad angle camera. I'm tired. Now we're gonna drive it in real quick. Sorry, get my tool ready. There it is. Now we have these side trims. This one here is gonna go here. You just connect it right in there, right there. And then these go right here. Sweet. Uh, okay. Okay. Try that again real quick with both hands. Yeah, the two hand method is always better. <laughs> Let's go to the other side now with this other trim tool. Uh, trim tool, trim piece. All right, same thing. This one's gonna latch right there. And I think I might use the two hand method. Huh. The one hand method work on this time. Once you have everything in the front tied up, what you're gonna do is put in one of the, of the two screws that you took out from the rear the first time you removed it. And we're gonna use a 10 millimeter socket. There it is, we just passed it up, there it is. And we're just gonna drive this in. All right, and we're gonna insert the cap, just like so, probably goes this way. There it is. Now we're gonna go to the other side and do the same. I'm just gonna drive in the screw. There it is, and then it's set, it's ready to go. And there it is, that's how you install a new center console on a 2016 Dodge Dart. Turbo, <laughs> thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Don't forget to hit that bell. All right, let's get out of here before we get kicked out.